the night when chaos and magic ignite the hell riot of fear. <laughs> Happy Halloween. The time when everyone thinks about goblins, ghosts, and witches. Do you believe in them? Beth certainly doesn't. But after this Halloween, well, <laughs> let's just say she might change her mind. <laughs> what a night. <laughs> what a Halloween. Hurry up, Beth. My guests are waiting. I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying. This is going to be some Halloween. Uh, Halloween schmalloween. What's with you? I'm too old for Halloween. No one's too old for Halloween. That's why I'm having my party. You should come. I think I'll pass, but thanks. You got a better offer? New girl at school. She just moved into the 13th floor. 13th floor. Just the place for it. <sighs> Come on, Beth. A party full of strangers. How much fun can that be? Mm. I got chocolate mud cake. <gasps> chocolate mud cake? And pizza. Come on, let's go to my party. Well... This is really kind of you, Mr. Grimaldin. No problem, Beth. Oh, I've got a present for you. Well, gee, thanks. But you can't open it till the Halloween hour, okay? Uh, well, what is it? Well, you'll just have to wait and see, won't you? I must have blood. Human blood. Perfectly reasonable. After all, it is the night of the living dead. Peter? Spare a little blood, Curly. Curly? You better watch your mouth, Peter Matheson. Uh, how'd you know it was me? I could see your ear sticking out. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Hey, you going to Meg's party? I promised I'd go to Mr. Grimaldin's for a while. Hey, you want to come? Oh, it'd be full of old geezers. Peter. Fourth floor, the best Halloween party in town. Oh, Meg. Hi. You are coming to my party, aren't you? She's already spoken for, Miss Robinson. You'll be sorry if you don't. I don't know, Beth. You want to go to Meg's? Oh, you'll be sorry. So, been to a Halloween party before? Nope, just trick-or-treating. Well, you better be careful. On Halloween, things can go terribly wrong. Well, like what? Oh, I don't know. Uh, people can just disappear. <laughs> okay, don't panic. There's got to be a logical explanation. Well, Peter, he, he just disappeared. You guys coming or what? <sighs> Old people can be a real pain sometimes. Wow, it's like the Night of the Living Dead. They don't look too alive to me. <laughs> oh, great makeup. Makeup? What makeup? Hello, kitties. What a fantastic full moon. I'm Peter. Ah! Four dollars at the magic shop. You can keep it if you like. Just in time to join our little ceremony. These guys are crazy. I'm out of here. Oh, give it a chance, Peter. We just got here. We'd be better off at Meg's. How do you do that? Years of practice. Beth, 
I've got a present for you. Oh, well, what is it? Could be a trick. Could be a treat. Oh, this is really cool, Mr. Grimaldin. Thanks. Just the thing. You can never have too many mirrors, right, Beth? Yeah, well, with your face, Peter, I bet you don't even have one. Oh, it's no ordinary mirror. It's magic. Yeah, sure. It comes with a magic word. Say it once and it wards off evil. Say it twice and you're doubly protected. Say it three times, uh, uh, well, no one's lived to tell the tale. So what's the magic word? This'll be good. Teroa Stroching, Yinny Yang Ping. Teroa Stroching, Yinny Yang Ping? By the time you said Teroa Stroching, Yinny Yang Ping, you'd be dead anyway. Now you've done it. That was three times. And the world's just ended, right? Oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> Zombie face, do you see this precious hourglass? Hmm? What are you supposed to be? A trick or a tree? This ain't no trick. That hourglass holds your fate, and as the sand falls, you'll know what I mean. Hope your magic's better than your poetry. From this glass, I command you to drink, or into the cauldron your sad souls will sink. See, the secret is to survive each scare, or I'll turn you into what you wear! I'll turn into a cat? Not just a cat. A witch's mangy cat. There ain't nothing worse than that. Now, let's get down to it, brat! She's gone. I'm out of here. <gasps> Peter, look! Uh, where am I? What'd you do with the witch? I mean, my mom? She was here? Oh, no. I'm in trouble. Wait, the witch? She's your mother? Well, that means... Yeah? You're a... Yeah? You're a witch! <laughs> That's right. First year apprentice, of course. Uh, I really messed up that last spell. I wonder where Mom went. I don't know, but thanks for saving us. She was trying to make us drink that stuff. Wait a minute. I didn't come here to save you. By the looks of the glass, you are now the victims of spell number 746. Nothing can save you. So you better start drinking. Look, I'm not going to take orders from you, Meg Robinson, you little... <gasps> Peter! Help! <laughs> now that one worked. Are you crazy? Turn her back! Are you gonna take your medicine? Yes, just bring her back! Oh, what happened? I'll tell you later. We gotta drink that stuff. Oh, no way! Beth, trust me, we gotta... Peter, are you gonna do everything she tells you? We don't have to drink it. She's bluffing. <laughs> There's plenty more where that came from. Oh, forget it. This stuff smells like dirty diapers. Sorry, Beth, but I'm in a hurry. You know, you're being a real man. Ow! Oh. Okay, oh, okay, okay, okay. I'll drink it. Wait. I'll go first. Fast service, no wait. I don't suppose we could discuss this? Drink! Uh, oh, God, what's happening? Oh, oh, thanks a lot, Beth. You see what I see? Uh, unfortunately. Come on, we're out of here. 
Oh, Peter, you're such a slow learner. Oh, we can't go through that door. Well, I'm not staying here. Do those pumpkins look friendly to you? <sighs> Hardly. Oh, all right, I'll give you a choice. Now what? One door of fire and one door of ice. Which do you choose? Some choice. Well, I want to be crushed to death by a flaming pumpkin. It'd be kind of messy, wouldn't it? Well, so which door? Fire or ice? I got a bad feeling about this. Well, we still got to go through. Well, then let's do it. Okay. What the? Having fun, Beth? Hey, these flames aren't so hot. The, the heat's down there. Oh, well, that's all right then. <laughs> sure is. Ah! You'll get yours, Meg. Not from you, Beth. That's for sure. <laughs> Meg, what do you think you're doing? Uh, uh, I must have got this spell wrong again. One more mistake and you're drummed out of the witch's guild. Now grab hold of the broom. We've got work to do. Happy landing, suckers! <laughs> oh, that little witch is really starting to annoy me. I think I'm getting used to this stuff. Oh, is that right? Well, check it out down there. Oh, no! Are we dead? Oh, can't be. I hurt too much. Ow. Hey, how did that get here? Hey, it's almost empty. Oh, well, that means the spell's almost over and we finally got rid of those two. Have a good trip. Not again. Great so? Haven't you done enough? Just starting, honey. <laughs> Stay cool. There's only a couple of minutes to go. Oh, Beth. <gasps> First rule of witches, always cheat. Right. No more Mr. Nice Guy. I'm gonna... Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, what the... One of our most popular deaths. Buried alive. <laughs> oh, look, Peter, your hand's bleeding. Oh, oh no. I'm turning into a zombie. I wouldn't worry about it. You'll be dead before then. <laughs> Hey, quick! Someone's coming! Don't go away. We'll be right back. <laughs> oh, oh, coast is clear. Move it! Peter, quick! This way! Well, well, well. Look who it is. Where's your mom? I don't know. I fell off her broomstick. <laughs> oh, hey, Peter, over there. There's a gate. I wouldn't go through there if I were you. Yeah, why not? The cemetery's haunted. Oh, sure. Go ahead, be my guest. Hmm. Well, what about the woods? Not a great idea either. Oh, I suppose that's haunted too. Ever heard of... A Halloween vampire? <laughs> no, but uh, I bet you're gonna tell me. Halloween vampires only come out on Halloween, and boy are they hungry. They don't waste time with blood. No, instead, they latch onto your neck, burrow into your ears, and suck your brains out! <laughs> Charming, Meg. Friends of yours? No way I'm going through the woods. Oh. Okay, the cemetery is haunted, the woods have got Halloween vampires, and we're being tailed by a psycho witch. Hmm, I think I'd rather be spooked than brain-sucked. 
Huh. Woods or cemetery? Beth, you better decide. <sighs> Graves, a crazy wannabe witch. Oh, this is too much. <laughs> It'll all be over soon. <laughs> oh, I, I can't see anything, Peter. Can you? Peter? Peter? Peter, where are you? Where, Peter? Oh! 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 What if I am? You're never gonna get out. You know that, don't you? Uh, Peter? Peter? Oh, Peter? this place the house of the dead oh, as if well, are you going in or what well nice choice Meg the house of the dead or a haunted cemetery life wasn't meant to be easy neither was death now make up your mind while you still can Central heating. What is this place? See all those bodies? It's a mausoleum. Feels just like home. You're enjoying this, aren't you? Oh, yes. Peter's down there. You up for it? I don't believe you. You'll never, never know if you never, never go. You've been lying to me all night. Remember the witch's words. If you don't survive each scare, the witch will make you what you wear. <laughs> And boy, does that go double for Peter. You're supposed to be his friend, aren't you? Where all the bodies are. How you doing, Beth? Knees a little wobbly. Peter? Peter, are you there? Peter, please. Beth, help me. Peter, come out. I can't. Why not? They turned me into a zombie. Oh, Peter, you already tried that one. Don't worry, Beth. It's all over. He's home now. You're... You're... Evil! <laughs> yeah. 
you don't know the half of it. are waiting. I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying. This is going to be some Halloween. Uh, Halloween schmalloween. What's with you? I'm too old for Halloween. No one's too old for Halloween. That's why I'm having my party. You should come. I think I'll pass, but thanks. You got a better offer? New girl at school. She just moved into the 13th floor. Thirteenth floor. Just the place for it. <sighs> Come on, Beth. A party full of strangers. How much fun can that be? Mm. I got chocolate mud cake. <gasps> chocolate mud cake? And pizza. Come on, let's go to my party. Well... Sorry, Mr. Grimaldin. Maybe later. <sighs> okay, just stay cool. <gasps> that was cool. <sighs> okay, there has got to be a logical explanation. <sighs> yeah, like maybe it's a real monster. <laughs> Oh gosh, now Beth, you're really talking to yourself. <sighs> oh, I don't know if this is such a good idea. Maybe I should just go to Mr. Grimaldin's. Probably just a serial killer. <gasps> Holy Halloween! Probably just, uh. just, uh. some sort of evil kid eating monster. <laughs> Gosh, these people are weird. Cancel that. These people are mega weird. <sighs> you know, this wasn't such a great idea. Maybe I will check out Mr. Grimaldin's. Zombie. I'll be 
Peter, you really freaked me. Aw, uh, Beth, how'd you recognize me? Well, your ears were sticking out of the sides of your mask. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <sighs> uh, what is that? They got a CD playing over there. <sighs> well, turn it off, will ya? Looks like we're the first ones here. <sighs> yeah, I've got a bad feeling about this. Peter! <laughs> I knew that! Yeah, sure you did. Gotcha! Trick or treat, suckers! <laughs> As if, Meg. Come on, admit it. It'd take a lot more than that to scare... So, where's everyone else? There is no one else. But help yourself to the chocolate chip cookies. Oh, now you're talking. Some for now? Some for later. So, some party. Oh, I wouldn't worry, Beth. I've got a special surprise just for you. Oh, is that your homework? Uh, <laughs> what, do you pull rabbits out of hats, too? <laughs> nope, just cast spells. So what are you going to, like, fly around on a broomstick? <laughs> Something like that. You know, you really take Halloween seriously, don't you? <laughs> oh, hey! What is this, a voodoo cookbook? Can't tell you. If you knew, I'd have to put a curse on you. Really? Uh, come on, Peter. Even a bunch of old fogies would be better than this no-show. Well, come on, should we go? Can't stand oldies. They drool and fart all the time. Great! It's time for a spell. First, we need a pentacle. Now we all hold hands. I must be kidding. Oh, come on, Beth. Get into it. Scared, Beth? In your dreams. Evil spirits. Demons of hell. Grant me the power to conjure a spell. Expose the darkness. Burn the white light. Make Halloween a terrible night. <gasps> What's that? Oh, I'm gonna kill you, Peter. <laughs> Nearly fooled you. By the power of ancient black magic tricks, sticks devil stones, and stones devil witch. Bring to me that which I seek. <gasps> which witch do you mean? <laughs> Bring to me that which I seek. Maybe you've got the wrong page. I call down the forces of darkness. <sighs> Don't give up your day job. <laughs> Hear my cry, oh force of the dark. Ooh, must be a bit deaf. <laughs> Look, it's been really fun, Meg, but we gotta go now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh? What do you mean, uh-oh? Uh, it wasn't supposed to... No, uh, not that page. Oh, it must be here somewhere. You ever done this before, Meg? It's my first time with this book, okay? Oh, man. Hey, it worked. You show promise, child. Yes, well, you know, I'm just starting out, but... But you've made the worst mistake of your life and your last. What? <laughs> Demon spirits, you make me scream, awakening me on Halloween. Uh, yes, well, um, my friend Beth and me just popped in for a minute and, well, we'll be on our way now. Just try it! <laughs> oh! I, I, I can't move! My feet are stuck! <laughs> that magic glass there holds your fate. Three curses of terror, of evil, of hate. With an hour left till midnight's pain, I'll time your plight with each single grain. The secret is to survive each scare, or I'll turn you into what you wear! <laughs> 
Don't worry. I'll make sure they do everything we want them to. We? You fool. You're in this as deep as they are. Uh, in what? Simple, you simpleton. A devil, a cat, and a zombie undead. <laughs> You'll become these monsters just like I said. <sighs> nice one, Meg. I must have messed up the spell, okay? <sighs> hey, hey, my feet aren't stuck anymore. Oh, me either. Oh, I can't stop this thing. I don't want to be no zombie undead. Yeah, well, it's better than spending the rest of your life as a cat. So what do we do? <sighs> we'll lock the door and stay right here until that hourglass runs out. Hang on. There's something strange about that couch. <laughs> <laughs> Give me your spear, I'll kill it! Are you insane? It's probably an undead snake! No one can kill it. Uh, we gotta get out of here! Just wait! This isn't happening! Uh, there's no way I'm walking down there! So, who's got plan B? Get away from me, you freak! Wait! Where are you going? Plan B! <laughs> but there is no escape for that. Snakes, fire, statue! She said three curses! Yeah? And they're all after us! Are you kids all right? Not exactly. A uh, slight problem with the apartment. Can't be more important than Halloween. Well, actually, time for trick or treat. Oh, I'm kind of Halloweened out. You ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> Mom, you gotta teach me that one. Well, hang on. If that's your mother... Yeah? You must be, uh... A witch. <laughs> First year apprentice, of course. Trick or treat! <laughs> you survived the first curse. Now this'll be worse. This time you can choose. But believe me, you'll lose. No! Here, run! 
you do that? Years of practice. Okay, team. Now for our next adventure. An hour? There's no way I'm hanging out with you. Really? Then how does a million years listening to new kids on the block sound, hmm? Like a good reason to hang out with Meg. Oh, don't worry, Peter. Trust me. I'm a witch. Now lay the next one on us, Mother. Oh, please, no more bad poetry. Watch your mouth, kid. Your Halloween journey forks at two roads. You may enter the fire or make light clothes. That is to say, you must not stay. Go into the washing machine and become the next load, or jump into the fire to be fried like a toad! Gosh, <laughs> if they think I'm gonna climb into a washing machine, they can forget it. Couldn't fit anyway. Now you can! <laughs> Let's go, Peter! <gasps> Boy, I had it with you, Meg. Now pay attention. <clears throat> if neither choice you choose to dare, the witch will make you what you wear. Oh, spare me. So I advise you both take lots of care. Cause this next curse... Uh... Will be really rotten? Is sure to scare, dummy. Now, let the fun begin. What do we do? The choices are right in front of you. <sighs> Gigantic washing machine or fiery furnace? Oh, nice choices, Meg. Well, you better decide and quick. <sighs> the washing machine it is. Yeah. That smells gnarly. Well, I'm gonna get you for this, Meg. <laughs> sure you are. Have a good trip. You know, you can wash a lot of clothes in this thing. Oh, uh, look for something to hold on to, Peter. What? She's going to turn it on. She wouldn't, would she? Time to clean up your act, Ben. Hey, look, a Smashing Pumpkins t-shirt. Oh, yeah, well, we're the ones who are gonna get smashed. Ow! You, you could be right. Oh, I wish I'd listened to myself and stayed home. Ow! Oh, I wish I was anywhere else but here. Oh, nice work, Peter! How was I to know? Next time, keep your wishes to yourself! <laughs> Out of the frying pan and into the fire! But we didn't choose the fire! It was a metaphor, you moron! A what? Are we dead? Oh, can't be. I hurt too much. Ow. Hey, how did that get here? Hey, it's almost empty. Oh, well, that means the spell's almost over and we finally got rid of those two. Have a good trip. Not again. Great, so? Haven't you done enough? Just starting, honey. <laughs> Stay cool. There's only a couple of minutes to go. Oh, Beth. <gasps> First rule of witches. Always cheat. Right. No more Mr. Nice Guy. I'm gonna... Ah! Ah! What the... One of our most popular deaths. Buried alive. <laughs> oh... Look, Peter, your hand's bleeding. Oh, oh no. 
I'm turning into a zombie. I wouldn't worry about it. You'll be dead before then. <laughs> Man, quick! Someone's coming! Don't go away. We'll be right back. <laughs> is clear. Move it! Peter, quick! This way! Well, well, well. Look who it is. Where's your mom? I don't know. I fell off her broomstick. <laughs> oh, hey, Peter, over there! There's a gate! I wouldn't go through there if I were you. Yeah, why not? The cemetery's haunted. Oh, sure. Go ahead, be my guest. Hmm. Well, what about the woods? Not a great idea either. Oh, I suppose that's haunted too? Ever heard of a Halloween vampire? <laughs> no, but uh, I bet you're gonna tell me. Halloween vampires only come out on Halloween. And boy, are they hungry. They don't waste time with blood. No. Instead, they latch onto your neck, burrow into your ears, and suck your brains out! <laughs> Charming, Meg. Friends of yours? No way I'm going through the woods. Oh. Okay. The cemetery is haunted, the woods have got Halloween vampires, and we're being tailed by a psycho witch. Hmm, I think I'd rather be spooked than brain-sucked. Huh. Woods or cemetery? Beth, you better decide. Hmm. <sighs> How do you know if it's a Halloween vampire? I don't know. Pumpkins on their heads. Oh, this is serious, man. <gasps> Ow! Thorns! What do you mean, thorns? I'm stuck! Oh, you can't be stuck. Ah! Oh, no. Now I'm stuck. Oh, okay, just don't panic, all right? Panic? I'm not panicking. I just like having a brain, okay? You've got by without using it until now. Oh! Ow! Ah! Just keep running. Hurry up. Through that gate. Can't open it. The lock's clear. What? Wow, it's a bunch of skeletons and they're coming this way. That's it. We're dead. Open the gate. I can't. It's stuck. Oh, they're coming. They're coming. What's that over there? Oh, no. Rats, hundreds of them. And they're heading straight for us. Oh, gosh. Oh, Peter! Meg! Oh, not you again! You see those rats? They're no ordinary rats. They're vulture rats. <laughs> well, get them away from me! No point in kicking them off. They love fresh toes. Hi there. What's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? Ugh! Oh, Meg, get your bony friend away from me. Oh, don't be like that. How about a dance? Ugh! Go for it, Beth! It's the dance of death. Just a few minutes and it'll all be over. Come on, honey. How about a flea? <laughs> you sure know how to get a girl. Beth! Oh, Peter. Come here. Give me some of those cookies. Cookies? You want to eat cookies now? Sh quickly! Oh, you've lost it, Beth. You know that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just keep kicking the rats. Okay, Boney, let's dance. You leave or shall I? <laughs> Whatever's good for you. Strike up the band. Oh, oh the, the knee bone, bone connected to the thigh bone. The thigh bone connected to the hip bone. The hip bone connected to the back bone. Them bones all connected to me. Them bones, them bones, them dry bones, them bones, them bones, them dry bones, them bones, them bones, them dry bones, them bones all connected to me. Oh, you dance very well. My friends say I got rhythm in my bones. The rats! They're leaving! They're going away! 
Oh, well, I guess I'll just have to finish you off myself. Oh, 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 I'm zombifying. I bet you wish you came as a superhero, huh? <laughs> this dance of death thing sure is fun. Enjoy it. It won't last much longer. Ow! What's that? Oh, that's the rat. They're after my cookie crumbs. Ah, get away! You're only supposed to eat humans! Hey! This wasn't supposed to happen! <laughs> Enjoy! It won't last much longer! Peter, are you okay? I must have blood! Oh, Peter, cut it out! Ah, help me! I'm joined the undead! Peter, please! What's happening? You okay? <sighs> no, I'm not okay. Where's the skeletons? Oh, I guess they've gone to that great big ballroom in the sky. Wow, excellent. Yep, now they're with the Grateful Dead. <laughs> well, what happened? Why are we still alive? <sighs> Long story, Peter. Come on, let's go. I don't know what the world's coming to. You just can't get good help these days. There'll be trouble when we get home, young lady. Ah, oh, Mom. Don't you ah, uh, Mom, me. I told you, one spell, one trick. That's all. No treat for you this year. I... I just got carried away. You'll get carried away all right if you try that again. Now clean up this mess. Uh, it's not fair. It's not supposed to be fair. That's what parents are for. Next Halloween, I'm hiding under my bed. Uh, who cares about Halloween? What? Hey, we know spells now. We can call up witches whenever we want. Huh? A joke, Peter. It's just a joke. Oh, yeah. Right. The next time you think of Halloween, whatever you do, don't think of witches. Because if by accident you utter the wrong words, it might be Halloween forever! <laughs>